Hello everyone. Um, there is a, a breaking news out here that have been put out by presidency and it says Shetima cancels Commonwealth trip after foreign object reportedly hit plane in US. Kashim Shetima has aborted his trip to the 2024 Commonwealth Heads of uh, Government Summit in Samoa after his plane was reportedly hit by foreign object. Bola Tinibu had earlier delegated uh, uh, Kashim Shatima to represent the country at the ongoing summit. But in a statement on Thursday night, which is last night, right? The presidency announced that Shatima's trip had been cancelled, explaining that a foreign object hit his plane during a stopover at JFK Airport in New York. The foreign object damaged the cockpit windscreen of the plane. Uh, Bayo Onanuga said in a statement, disclosing that a ministerial delega a delegation would now represent Nigeria. Tinibu, acting promptly, has approved a ministerial delegation to represent Nigeria at the summit uh, in the Samoa capital of Apia, while the plane's repair has commenced. The delegation will now represent Nigeria at the 2024 Commonwealth Heads of Government meeting in Samoa, uh, uh, the delegation that we now head it is now being led by Minister of Environment Balare B. Abbas Lawal. The summit began on the uh, Pacific Island on 21st October. It will end on 26th October. Shatima and Foreign Minister Yusuf uh, Tugar have left New York for Nigeria. Let me do, let me do a bit of uh, uh, explanation here, a bit of talk. First of all, they want to buy a new plane. I can assure you of that. The next thing you're going to hear is that, oh, they bought a new plane. This was the same thing that was done. Uh, I think, what, what trip was it? Was it that uh, Chinese trip? Or was it the Saudi Arabia trip that Tinibu undertook? That he went from Holland, Netherlands to there. Oh, that they also they said the plane had uh, the plane, uh, the presidential plane had spoiled. So they now had to bring uh, Shetima's plane. Then when they brought Shetima's plane, Shetima's plane had stopped. Shetima's plane was not working. And then they took blah, 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 blah. Long story. I remember when I did that video, I said the next thing, these people are going to buy a new uh, presidential jet. In no time, uh, you people matter. You people will die of hunger. Those people will do what they want to do. They went to buy their presidential jet, whatever, got approval. Them gave Nigeria middle finger, still giving Nigeria middle finger anyway, did what they were going to do, how they were going to do it, the way they were going to do it, and that was it. La, 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 done. Now again, the same, the same kind of uh, 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 mode of operation. For a foreign trip, and they were in the foreign trip, the plane has had problem. They've left it there. It's, it's being fixed. Now they are coming to Nigeria, blah, blah, blah. The second part of all these things that I'm going to take on is the fact that, eh? so first of all, uh, a, a program was supposed to start 21st. Today is what? Let me even check today's date. Definitely today. Today is 25th, I think. So it's at the tail end of the of the closure. Let me let me just check date. Today is Friday, 25th. Yesterday was Thursday, 24th. So. It had the tail end. Okay, let's say it was yesterday that according to this statement came out, they on their way, whatever. It's at the tail end they are going. Okay, maybe Nigeria is a big, big brother of that whole show. He's a big guy. It really doesn't need to be that. So, mm, anyhow, they will just come in. When they come in, you know, it's the US, US of Africa now. You decided that you're going to go this late. And then, while you're at a stopover, a foreign object hit the windscreen. It, you now have to repair it. So you've now packed. There is someone that was already on the way to that journey. Eh? Now you've packed ministers. You've mobilized ministers. Remember that these ministers that are being mobilized, uh, they are going to be paid something. It's called, is it per diem or Esther code or whatever they call it. And so they are going to be paid this money new arrangement everything new allowance whatever to go there paid money maybe the ministers are also going with other whatever blah 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 blah, blah. and entourage we go this whole entourage 
we turn to a whole new set of monies that will be wasted. Just was it just yesterday or just the day before yesterday? You know, uh, Tinubu said he brought out a new ministerial. It's me. I didn't talk about it. I don't have that. The only thing that I actually knew I made fun of was uh, uh, what do you call him now? Uh, Reno Mokri, Daniel Boala, Asin, uh -uh. Where are they? Are they no day for lease? But other than that, for me, it has just a distraction that really doesn't have anything. This government is an illegitimate government, it's an illegitimate government. I don't really waste my time, you know, focusing on whatever on it. But just a few days ago, uh, Tinibu was said to have said that the ministers, uh, as in they are trying to cut cost of governance, ministers cannot travel with more than, is it three extra or five or something, something like that. Now, you that you said you are cutting cost of governance, You've carried a new set of people to come from here, Nigeria, start going to Samoa to go and do this conference or whatever that was supposed to have, that have started how many days ago. The Kashim Shatima that was already on his way there, he cannot enter jet and go there. Let's even say in your usual wasteful manner, he cannot get a private jet and go there from there. Because that one has already been mobilized. Be sure the estaco whatever has already been done into his this thing. Now you're mobilizing a new set of because uh, like I used to usually say, with his two left legs, he cannot walk out from New York and walk out to that place. No, now he has to come back to Nigeria. Then a different way, and then they are writing in the statement that uh, Tinubu took action immediately because Shetima could not go there, so he mobilized. Most uh, ministers from here that will cost Nigeria more money for them to go there. You know, I used to think, you know, when I talk uh, uh, like people, it's, oh, I shall run for this, I shall run for office, I shall become governor, I shall become senator. Like, I used to tell them, I was like, what do I even know? Me, I don't, I'm too lazy. I don't, what, do I, what do I do in the government? I said, these people that are there, what do they know? You know, and now I true to they understand what my husband they talk. What do they know? Because even me, where they say I don't know anything. Eh? For this presidency, as I don't sit in it, good on Joker. Ah, I'm mommy for even do better. Yeah? I'll have the, I'll have the girls to be able to say, ah, this thing, we will fix this thing. That oil theft, eh? for don't stop her. By fire, you stop her. Or any chief, any chief of uh, whatever, military, army staff, or whatever, so we no stop her. As you no stop her, you will stop your job. So you see that you stop it eh, and have a job. Or focus on the three hundred thousand dollars bribe you will get and not have a job. But honestly, I'm just I'm just sitting here. I'm just thinking. I'm like, oh no. But you know what? Eh? Let me tell you again. They will soon buy a jet. It doesn't matter that people are crying. It doesn't matter that there are no cars on the road. There are really no cars on the road. Drive out what you used to have your busy time before and see. Maybe I'll talk about that in another video. But anyway, shall I say, let me quickly do this while it's breaking. You say, just get ready and I will soon buy it. Thank you for watching. Bye.